The first question: Do people like tea and coffee nowadays? Well, that's no brainer that people enjoy coffee and tea in my country nowadays. As when you wander around the city, you can just see a lot of coffee shops and tea shops around you. And plus, no matter you are a student or a worker, you like to have a cup of coffee or tea,、uh, which is a perfect morning pick me up. Two. Do you prefer to use tea or coffee to serve your guests? Well, that surely depends. If those visitors are not those whom I know very well, I will ask them about their preferences. But if those are my close friends, I automatically offer them coffee, since all of them are really coffee holics. Three. When was the last time you had a cup of coffee? Well, it's funny to say that I've drunk a cup of. Pour over coffee this morning, and you know it's my weekly routine to visit an Instagram worthy coffee shop with my husband. And simply because you know having a cup of coffee、um, can just keep me energetic all through the day. Four. Do you usually buy your coffee in a coffee shop? Well, only once or twice in a week, and I believe it's a perfect place to catch up with friends or talk with baristas. And most importantly, I'm quite into the relaxing vibe that the coffee shop provides. But more often than not, I will make it at home, as it's a lot cheaper. Do people like tea and coffee nowadays? Yes, definitely. I think most people in China, especially among the youngsters, they really like to start their day with a cup of coffee.、Um, as the average sleeping hours has gradually decreased, so I guess people need this kind of coffee to maintain. Their efficiency and try to be more energetic. In terms of tea, I would say you see Chinese people love drinking milk tea and bubble tea, even though it it contains a lot of sugar.、Um, still, it's rather a popular beverage in China, so people like to drink tea and coffee. And the next question is: Do you prefer to use tea or coffee to serve your guests? I'd rather serve them with sparkling water or just plain water, because I guess they're to some extent much healthier. But anyways, I would give them the option. For example, I would ask them whether they want tea or coffee or just water, and if they said coffee, I would also make it for them. And the next question is: When was the last time you had a cup of coffee? Um, although I mentioned that I'm not much of a coffee lover, I have to admit that this morning I actually made a avocado latte.、Um, the reason is that I've browsed a short video saying that it tastes okay, and since you know avocado is my favorite, so I tried it. To be honest, it looks good, but it just tastes terrible. So the last question is: Do you usually buy your coffee in a coffee shop?、Um, see, I don't drink coffee, so, but. Whenever I visit a cafe, if I'm going to spend some time there, reading or writing or working, then I would order a cup of coffee. I think it's like a basic manner for you to stay in a cafe. I wouldn't really drink it though. But maybe in the future, if I fall in love with coffee, I guess I'd rather buy a coffee machine rather than buying it from coffee shop because I guess the process of making it is still rather satisfying. Do people like tea and coffee these days? Yes, of course. I think people around the world would choose either tea or coffee to start a day, because we all know that there's caffeine in tea and coffee, so it can make people feel energetic and it helps them to concentrate on their work, especially for young people. Also, it can boost their metabolism, so it's good for their health. Do you prefer to use tea or coffee to serve your guests? Well, personally, I'm a big fan of coffee, but I prefer to use tea to treat my guests because it's more convenient. You know, you just need some tea bags and hot water to make tea, but、um, for a cup of coffee, you need to open the coffee machine, and it takes a while to prepare all the materials. When was the last time you had a cup of coffee? Well, this morning I had a latte I made for myself at home because I have a coffee machine. I enjoy operating the machine a lot because there's a lot of fun. Also, I can choose the coffee beans I like. For example, I chose、um, the beans with the flavor of red wine this morning. Do you usually buy your coffee in a coffee shop? Yes, of course. I think at least twice a week because、um, there are so many coffee shops here in my city. And、uh, when I'm busy heading to my workplace, I can just grab the coffee and go. 
Also on weekends, I would go to different kinds of coffee shops with my friends because there are some shop, uh, coffee shops that offer good quality coffee beans that you cannot buy by yourself. The first question is, do people like tea or coffee nowadays? Yes, sure. Tea and coffee are probably the two most popular drinks nowadays. In such a fast-paced world, I mean the society pursuing high productivity and efficiency, that people sleep less and they do need the caffeine to let them be more energetic and productive instead of being exhausted. The second question, do you prefer to use tea or coffee to serve your guests? Well, I prefer using small bottles of mineral waters to serve my guests. This way, I don't have to worry about making coffee or tea to match their taste preference. Plus, I am a bit lazy when it comes to additional dishwashing duties. Additionally, the small bottle of mineral waters is practical. This allows guests to enjoy water conveniently anytime, anywhere. The third question. When was the last time you had a cup of coffee? Well, the last time I enjoyed a cup of coffee was just yesterday. I found myself feeling quite drowsy during the afternoon. So I decided to grab a cup of an orange Amer Americano to pick up. I particularly like Americano because it is really low in calories compared to milk-based coffee options. Additionally, the infusion of vitamin C from the orange juice in coffee is really a health bonus. The last question, do you usually buy your coffee in a coffee shop? I don't usually buy my coffee from coffee shops. I prefer making my coffee at home because it allows me to control the flavor and strength to suit my taste perfectly. It's also more cost effective in the long run. However, on occasionally, I do enjoy visiting coffee shops with friends for a change of environment and taking some selfies, but it's not a daily habit for me.